In the meantime, some new data shows that small manufacturers cut their investments in their plants and equipment by 50 percent in the second quarter of this year. Our Phil LeBeau is live in Chicago to tell us why this is happening. Phil? It's all about uncertainty, Carl. And really, this is a troubling statistic. I want to show you a chart that we received from PayNet, which monitors 20 million small business loans uh, with 17 million businesses around the country. Look at the fall off here in terms of the amount of investment made by small manufacturers. And what you really want to look there is towards the end in the third quarter. It fell off dramatically. Well, according to PayNet, small manufacturers cut their investment in plants, in equipment by 50% in the second quarter. One of the troubling sectors, transportation equipment, the investment there for those manufacturers fell off by 33%. And according to the folks at PayNet, this all comes down to manufacturers manufacturers pulling back because of uncertainty. There was certainly a lot of uncertainty about how to implement affordable health care, how to you know, react to the tax rates that were coming down the pike, whether or not the deficit problem was going to be addressed. Bottom line, uncertainty about the economy. And we're also seeing some troubling statistics when it comes to the ISM index. Remember, it fell below 50. Anything below 50, Carl, shows a contraction when it comes to manufacturing. Bottom line, Carl, you know, during the campaign, you saw the White House, you saw Republicans. They're always going out to these small manufacturers, and they're saying, we want to build manufacturing in this country. You know what? This statistic shows what we're hearing from small manufacturers everywhere. They're fed up with the stalemate in Washington. They want resolution here. Now, they're not saying what resolution they want, but they do want resolution. Otherwise, they're going to sit on the sidelines with their capital. Uh, you got that right. And the ISM probably just the first signal of uh, that happening in a bigger way if things don't happen the way they should. Thanks, Phil.